Hi, I'm pro saxophonist Jamie Anderson and you're watching Get Your Sax Together. I sax up your Sunday every week with technique tips, player profiles, tips on playing great solos and, of course, my famous breakdowns of the world's best loved sax lines. In today's free online sax lesson, you'll be learning how to play one of the most famous sax lines of all time, and that's Stuart Matthew Moon's iconic hook on Smooth Operator by Sade. Smooth Operator is from Sade's 1984 debut album Diamond Life and features the tenor sax of multi-instrumentalist band member Stuart Matthew Men, aka Cottonbelly. This track is the very definition of smoochy romantic sax and unlike some of the other difficult breakdowns you've seen on this channel recently, I'm talking forget-me-nots and urgent here, this one is suitable for beginners on sax, especially beginners on tenor sax. If you play alto, you just have to make sure you've got a nice, reliable low B, or you could take it up the octave. In the interests of brevity and to cater for less experienced players, this lesson only covers the main intro hook, not the full solo in the middle. Let me know in the comments if you want to learn the main solo, and if there's enough interest, I'll break that down for you at a later date. And while you're in the comments, let me know what your top smoochy romantic sax track of all time is. <laughs> Before we learn the first phrase, make sure you go down into the description for this video and click the link to get your free PDF sheet music for Smooth Operator, which is lovingly transcribed by yours truly for tenor and alto sax. And keep watching to the end of the video, not just because of the amusing blooper reel, but because I've included a free backing track for Smooth Operator that you can play along to. So, without further ado, here's the first phrase broken down in slow motion. Just before we move on to the second phrase, let me quickly mention my free Saxophone Success Masterclass. It's a totally free and exclusive one hour video lesson with loads of in-depth teaching to help you transform your tone and technique, improvise a great solo, and design a structured daily routine so you don't waste your precious practice time with junk playing. The best part is, of course, it's totally free. <laughs> Just go to the link in the description or you can visit www.getyoursaxtogether.com forward slash masterclass. Okay, without further ado, let's look at phrase two now. Here it is, played nice and slowly. <laughs> If you listen to the original, you'll hear that Stuart Matthew Men scoops up to certain notes. If you want to learn how to do that properly, check out the video linked on the card above now, which shows you how to do every kind of bend, fall, scoop, or glissando you can imagine. <laughs> Moving on then, the third phrase that's played in the song is exactly the same as phrase one. So the final phrase, phrase three for us, is actually the fourth phrase that you'll play when you come to perform the whole song. <laughs> Clear as mud. Here it is in slow motion. You might notice that lovely blues note in the last phrase, the B flat for tenor or F natural for alto. I've done a whole lesson on the blues, explaining those blue notes and much, much more. Just use the card linked above now to watch it. So we've now got all the notes for the intro line. However, as a special bonus, I'm gonna throw in one more phrase which is used throughout the song as a filler part. You'll recognize it when you hear it, and if you know the song, you'll know where to chuck it in. This bonus phrase is phrase four. <laughs> Okay, let's put this whole thing together now. Remember to get your free PDF from the description to follow along with each phrase as I play it. You're gonna play phrase one, phrase two, phrase one again, and then phrase three. I've put together a backing track for this one, and after I've performed the song, you can play with it on your own. As always, it's essential to go and listen to the original song and mimic the phrasing, timing, and tone if you wanna sound convincing. There's a two-bar intro before the sax comes in. Here we go.
So that's it for this Sunday. Thank you so much for watching and supporting this channel. And I really hope you enjoyed learning Stuart Matthewman's iconic tenor hook on Smooth Operator. Just before we get to the funky end card music and blooper reel, if you want to learn some more in-depth sax stuff, go to www.getyoursaxtogether.com forward slash masterclass and get your free one hour lesson with me. And as always, you can support me by giving this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and check out my Insta and Facebook pages. Coming up next Sunday, you wanted jazz and your wish is my command. So we're going to learn the basics of jazz 251s. Until then, sayonara saxers. <laughs> This one is suitable for beginners on sax, especially, especially, why yes, Felix, take off that grass skirt. And features the tenor sax of most, oh, <clears throat> one more time. <laughs>